Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So find the Taylor series for this function centered at 5. So press pause and have a go. Okay, so to do this, um, uh, try and visualize this in your mind. So it would look something like this. And then we would start out with our general power series. Let's just say it looks something like this. Let's just say it looks something like that. And then because it's centered at 5, we would then apply this transformation. We would apply this transformation, so so everything here gets shifted across by by five. So uh, so it would look something like this. So it would look something like this, centered at five. So it would look something like this. So uh, so you start out with, with your general power series, apply this transformation, and then uh, and then now it looks like this. So now uh, now you would then differentiate this, differentiate this, differentiate this, differentiate this, and then you would differentiate this. Differentiate this, differentiate this, differentiate this, and so on, all the way to infinity. You would demand that the first derivative of this to match up with the first derivative of this. You would demand the second derivative to match up with the second derivative. Even the uh, the original function match up with this. So so by you making those demands, this purple line here will slowly map on top on top of your uh, of your of the function that you're trying to investigate, and and the the uh, the the uh, the equation for this line here is given by by this by this is 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 what you're familiar with. This is your your Taylor series. The the point that I'm trying to make is that when you start out with your general with your general power series, and then and then when you make this transformation, meaning you move everything across by five, you will introduce this um, by you making this transformation, you will introduce this x minus five. That's why your Taylor series contains x minus 5, x minus 5, x minus 5. You, because, because you're centering it at, uh, at 5, you need to make this transformation. But, but when you make this transformation, your Taylor series contains x minus 5. So going back to here, going back to, um, going back to your original function, you need to introduce this, uh, this x minus 5. Uh, but so, so that when you come to expand it, your, your expansion will contain x minus 5. Uh, uh, to the power of 1, x minus 5 to the power of 2, and so on. You need to introduce this x minus 5. But the thing is, when, when you, when you, um, when you introduce this, uh, this x minus 5, x minus 5, um, this is no longer the same as this. So, so you need to make this adjustment. So here you've got minus times a minus 5, that would be a positive 5. So let's just take away that 5. So now, this would be exactly the same as this, but just written differently. So now let's tidy this up, um, uh, tidy this up, so that will then become uh, negative 4, and then you've got your minus the bubble here, which should be x, um, x, x minus 5, and then tidy this up again. Let's, let's factor out the, uh, the negative 4, so factor out the negative 4, so it will look something like this, uh, 1, and then, and, then, uh, uh, and then plus the bubble, x minus 5 over 4. So, uh, so, so, so now, uh, now, now, now if you look at this, this times this, that will then give you negative 4. This times this will then give you negative this thing here. So this whole thing here is exactly the same as this, which is exactly the same as this, which is our function, exactly the same as our function. So now, uh, now if you look at this, 1, 1 plus, now this is our new bubble here. Okay, so so here you've got um, here you've got one one plus the bubble. So we, we can make use of this. Uh, we can make use of, of 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 this now. Okay, so so we can make use of this because if you look at this here, you've got your th th this is it, it's just a constant. Now we can make use of this. So now you've got your one one and then our new bubble here. This is our new bubble. So you you've got your one. 1 and then plus uh, plus our bubble here so so we can now expand this uh, in the next video okay